I'm a tiny tiger in a brave new world gonna free this town If you didn't know about me already, well you know it now Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Objectivist Girl and that song you just heard is my new song, Shrug. Um, I am interested in philosophy, politics, history, and of course economics. Uh, behind me you'll see the Free State Project flag. Uh, I moved to the Free State Project about three months ago, and it's been an amazing experience. I recommend it to anybody. You can find out more information about the Free State Project below. So the big question that you probably have for me at this point is why do I use the word shrug? Which is a good question because I'm going to be using that word over and over and over again uh, until you're sick of hearing it, right? So Atlas was a gentleman in Greek mythology that held up the celestial sphere. Um, he was sentenced by Zeus to do this. So why was he sentenced is the big question. He and his brother Mennonitis uh, sided with the Titans in the war against Olympus. Uh, so when the Titans were defeated, Mennonitis and the other Titans were sentenced to Tardis. And Atlas was sentenced to hold up Uranus next to Gaia, the Earth. And so why did he put up with this is another good question. He put up with this because Zeus made it so that um, whoever took the earth, and you'll see Atlas in the myth constantly trying to trick someone into taking it from him. Somebody has to willfully take it from him, and then they'll forever hold the sphere until somebody else is willing to willfully take it from them. The big conclusion that I'm coming to here is that Atlas is a good representation for our business corporations. And Ayn Rand uses Atlas in her books to represent businesses. Now, um, the thing is, is that businesses are holding us up from our symbolic death our economic debt. So I'm going to give you many good reasons why it is that we should help businesses grow and prosper and why we should take up a little bit of holding up that celestial sphere to help businesses because us helping them is going to make their job easier and help all of us in the long run. That is why I'm an objectivist and why I'm passionate about objectivism. And I'm going to give you many other reasons why I'm passionate about objectivism. But that was really the starting point in my journey towards objectivism. Um, and I hope you're. Unless you're already familiar with it, and that's also really exciting. But I just want to thank you for tuning into my channel. And I want to ask you, what is it that you shrug today? What is something that you're tired of doing and you don't think you should have to do it anymore? And tell me why, why you're passionate about shrugging this thing. So you can leave that in the comments section below. I'm very excited to hear from all of my subscribers. So below I've included links to my Facebook, Twitter, and blog, and also a link to laurenrumpler.com so you can listen to my new song, Shrug. Hopefully this is gonna make it an Atlas Shrug part three of the movie. Again, I just wanna thank you for tuning in and just tell you that to always remember that knowledge is not for all men, but for those who seek it. So please always keep seeking.